Ryan, you got loose again with another screen screen pass. What's been the key to making those plays work? It seems like every time they call that your way, it's turned into a big play. Yeah, just uh, the blocking. Uh, really, that's the uh, mix that's supposed to play the line. The cool guys that's holding this up, blocking and the receivers on the outside, you know, holding their guys to their side of the field. So that's really the key to the set. All I got to do is to catch it and just follow the block. So the block is the key to those screen plays. Big plays again in a passing game. How much does that does that juice up the offense to, to have a couple of those big plays like you guys have had? Yeah, big time? because uh, Coach Burns and uh, Coach Lindsey, they challenge us that uh, these next four games that receivers got to lead the way and we got to make uh, the plays when we were called upon and on third downs and stuff like that. When it's not kind of time and those one-on-one -on -one matches, we just got to come down win and catch the 50-50 ball. Just those, the quick screen game, you guys are getting better and better. Is it just a feel thing? Yeah, just execution. Uh, that everybody, uh, all 11 guys doing their job and just trusting everybody to do their job and just executing, blocking, get hats on hats. And that's really the, uh, the key to tunnel screens and anything like that. Everybody get hats on hats and just fitting their guys up and, you know, obviously catch the ball and do what you do and get it. You guys can can now, you know, you just won. You can now look forward a little bit. Number one, Georgia coming up. The team just kind of had your number. How, how, how much are you guys looking forward to this? Yeah, we're looking forward to it. Uh, you know, it's a big game. It's a big rivalry. And uh, this is what we come to offer for games like uh, Georgia. And uh, they're in front of us right now. So we just got to do everything and come together and go back and play correct things we correct and uh, have less errors going to this game because it's a big game. It seemed like you guys threw the ball a lot more in the red zone today compared to past. How much more dangerous does it make this offense when you guys aren't yeah, just running it up Just there? switching it up, giving uh, teams a different look. Uh, uh, not being one position in the red zone because when you play teams like Texas and them, George and Alabama LSU, it's tough to run, just run it, and then all the time you got to give it a different look. So we figured just some more uh, red zone passes and things like that could open it up so we can just run the ball in the uh, red zone. Did you see a difference from Jared practicing this week and last week with him coming back to Texas? Did you see any more energy, more focus, see anything uh, like that? Jared's a consistent guy. He always locked in. Uh, he brings a uh, ton of energy. But yeah, I'm quite, yeah, he would definitely have to come back home and take and went in his state, he was definitely fired up about that. But Jared's a guy that always comes to work, brings a bunch of play every day. He's going to a guy each and every day. How happy for you guys as receivers that you were able to help him get this big win? A, a big game for him in, right. in Texas. Definitely. I know, uh, we always try to play for Jared and uh, also everybody else on the like, offensive line. We're trying to play for Jared, especially him coming home. But we just want to play for one another, uh, be a teammate, play for one another, and that helps us execute, and uh, it makes everybody happy. Right back.